Hey guys, welcome back. We are at the Bob's N-Scale Man Cave layout to do some N-Scale stuff. Today we're taking a look at the Bachman GG1 in N-Scale. This is a DCC and sound equipped locomotive and it's the Brunswick Green uh, Single Stripe PRR version. So we'll take a look at this. Prices online uh, anywhere from the uh, high 200s to mid or low 200s. So you got that going for you for an in-scale sound locomotive, but we're going to take a closer look. We're going to unbox this GG1 here. Plastic, soft plastic to protect the model. Got the model itself. So I just kind of let fall out onto my hand here. So there it is. We have quick start guide tucked away in here. Got an accessory bag with ladders and couplers. Quick start guide. Bachman's pretty uh, short and concise. We'll use that to go through the functions. You've got DCC locomotive, DCC equipped operation manual. You've got the Bachman warranty card and a color catalog from Bachman coming. Yeah, the 2017 one coming soon. So we'll go ahead and get started with this. Take a look at what you get with this locomotive. Next. All right, we're gonna go over some sounds here now that it's out of the box. Um, don't have my turntable to go over details, but real quick, I will point out a few details. You've got the pantograms here. You have a headlight, coupler, coupler cut lever. You've got the cab windows here on both sides. Crew access ladders. You've got nice truck detail there. And on the other side you have just more of the same. This is mirrored basically uh, on each end so they can run in either direction. These are operating. I just can't seem to get them up for some reason. Uh, I see the spring so I'm pretty sure they do operate. But I started bending stuff and that made me nervous. So we're going to skip showing that. All right, let's listen to some sounds here. Got the bell first on F1. Let me check F0 and make sure the light's working because I always want to check all functions. Yep, headlight works, LEDs. Very cool. All right, F1. F2. Now, when you press it, it holds until you let go, at least on this NC Power Pro Cab. F3. F4. I believe that's the pentagrams going up or down. Let me get rid of that. F5. Maybe that's the extra generator sound. F6. Motor sound. F7, maybe muted, I don't know, didn't get much of anything out of that, so, oh, F7's actually a headlight dim, Bob tells me I wasn't viewing this at the same time, but, if it were, that's, uh, that's about it, so, those are the functions, let's check this under smo uh, slow speed control. All right, F8 mutes this just like on any Soundtracks decoder. By the way, speaking of decoder, this is a Soundtracks DCC sound value decoder. Limited functions, but a lot of the same sounds that you get on all the Soundtracks products. We're gonna go ahead and move this thing at uh, one speed step and see what happens. Is this on 126, Bob? I believe it's on 126. All right, cool. So we'll move this. We're gonna follow it at one speed step. Very, very smooth, and it's moving along here. Just slight, oh, it looks like a little bit of a creep vibration, maybe. 
two, three, four, and five. Five it's smoothed out by. We'll switch direction and check the other way. One. Two. Three. A little bit of vibration in the chassis there. At one and two. Three seems pretty smoothed out. Four. bring it back up close so we can take a a close look at it as it passes by since uh, we don't really have a good run by here um, we will be doing like it basically going on to the turntable at the end of this video as a run by but that's about it so I'm gonna zoom in here so we can take a close look at it as it goes by here Again, that's one speed step that shows you pretty good slow speed control. Looks like the vibrations are even out already. Sometimes it's just a break-in that's required to kill a lot of uh, motor inconsistencies. Looks like there's a pause there, though. Here's the LED headlight. You can probably see F7's a dimmer, so that does work. And it's a nice white, crisp LED headlight. Well, that's it for operation. We will wrap up with some final thoughts and then a run by. Well, that's going to do it for this review of the Bachman N-Scale GG1 with sound. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed the sounds. Pretty smooth runner at slow speeds and uh, pretty good sounds coming out of the N-Scale locomotive uh, without any real vibration or uh, rattling or anything that you might hear on uh, kind of a bad decoder. This uh, is actually a really good decoder and I think a pretty good product. So hopefully it helps some of you inscalers out. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time right here on my channel. Take care.